serious development um, lectures have been going on and we've been talking about development of the uh, palate which is next okay so development of the palate and it's quite an interesting story it's quite a, uh, a straightforward story okay so development of the palate could also be known as what palatogenesis okay the process of formation of palate right so you could see you see this uh the primary palate secondary palate is that the palatal shelves grow elevate and fuse together okay so failure of any of this um palate to fuse will lead to other cleft leap okay that we earlier on discussed about so palatogenesis which is basically development or a process of uh, formation of the palate begins at the end of the fifth week of embryonic development. So the palate develops into two primordia, which will have the primitive palate or the primary palate. Primitive palate from the frontal nasal process forms the primary palate. Okay. Some people just say the primitive palate is the primary palate. Okay. So you see, this is the primary palate, which um, is good for you to always note that it is from the primitive palate. And also, there are two palatal processes from the two maxillary processes, okay? And they form the secondary palate, okay? So this secondary palate is from the two palatal processes of the maxillary process. Maxillary processes from both sides, all right? So just to recap, the primary palate, then we have uh, secondary palate coming from the palatal processes of the maxillary processes, okay? then they come together to fuse all right so uh the definitive palate is formed by the fusion of these three parts okay so primary palate is one secondary palate is two okay so the fusion of these three parts is actually what gets to form the palate that we have all right so each palatal process fuses with the posterior margin of the primitive palate okay the two palatal processes fuse with each other in the midline okay and the medial edges of the palatal processes fuses with the free lower edge of the nasal septum okay this separating the nasal cavities from each other and from the mouth let me repeat this last segment statement the medial edges of the palatal processes fuse with the free lower edge of the nasal septum and this will separate the two nasal cavities from each other and also form the mouth okay can you see that there's a can you see this this thing all right so this separation between your two nasal cavities was as a result of the fusion of these three palatal process basically the two okay two palatal processes two secondary palatal processes in the midline okay so the fused and the effect was up like this and it separated your nose okay so guys that's it about palatogenesis which is basically the development of the palate see you guys in the next tutorial and bye for now